Welcome back to The Road Show. This morning, In the Buzz, brought to you by The Comedy Connection. This morning, we're talking fashion, oftentimes in a relationship, right? There's one person that's a bit more into style. <laughs> He's already laughing than the other. So the question is, how do you help your partner dress better? Yeah. It's like the best question ever. That is a good question. In an online fashion <laughs> publication, they say the first uh, tip is to plan a date for shopping rather than go to a movie, go shopping. <laughs> I could just see Matt loving that, sure. right? So another tip is to just buy the clothes you want them to wear, right? And be sure to give lots of compliments when they wear something nice. Right. Now, you can also alert your partner when the clothes do not fit and help them <laughs> own a few good basics. Uh, now, for men, this includes a casual jacket, some leather shoes, and Ooh. polo shirts. Look, I would love to have someone take me like someone who knows like exactly fashion, what they're doing. someone who knows fashion yep. to take me and go like shopping yes. for stuff. Yes. Um, because yeah, I mean, as, as a guy, I really don't. Care. And I find you fashionable though. Oh, well, thank you. I you know? No, I, I appreciate do. it. I do. No. I would tell. I would tell you. I appreciate. Look, I appreciate that. Look, I, I was telling Audrey this morning. So, so I've got. Hang on. Hang I think on. His, maybe maybe we need. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna show, show a little leg. Okay. So I've got my These my are cool sneakers. my Adidas Stan Smiths on These today, are cool. right? So I had an older an older pair that I've had for you know a couple of years. You know, guys don't care like. They, they wear underwear when it's just down to like a strap. I, mean, <laughs> I live with five of them. I know. I mean, look, I mean, I know. There's nothing like everything else has disintegrated. It's just like the. It's the like elastic. here's your shirt. Yeah, it's not even that. It's just like the elastic no, band. It's like they, a they scrunchie. Guys, guys don't care. It's like a thong. So I. <laughs> so I had like an older pair, and my wife's like, "You got to get rid of these things. Right, like they, they were dirty and everything else." And I'm like, "Well, they were comfortable." Yeah. So I came in the house this past week, and there was a hole in the bottom of them. Right. Like you I'm working. Yeah, I'm like the mines or yes. something like that. And I, I picked it up and I'm like, oh, yeah, I gotta throw them out. You gotta throw them she out. She said, I'm not sorry to see them no, go. No, no. Or I will wear something, or I'll wear something, and this is what I get. I, this is what I get. She doesn't even say anything to me. She just gives me. And you know. One of those. Yeah. And then she'll walk away. <laughs> and then, you know, I have this guilt. It's this Catholic guilt in my head going, yeah. I know she doesn't like this. Right. I know she doesn't like what I'm wearing. Do you keep it on? Uh, sometimes yeah. I do. Yeah, yeah sometimes yeah, I, I do. It. Sometimes I'm like, I'm not changing. And other times uh. I'm like, oh, all right, I'm going to tell you. So that, I will say that to Matt. Oh, you're going to wear that? Right. And he's like, obviously. Yeah. But like, you know, there are things that women can do in their sure. relationships where you're like, oh, so you're going to wear that? Yes. Oh, I didn't know that was clean. Right. Those are usually my go to lines. Right. Um, <laughs> so. So oh, did you find that? You're right, I exactly. Shoved that exactly. to the bottom right. of your pile to hide away. Right, right. No. So, so a couple about a month or two ago, <laughs> we were at a, a going away party here at, at the TV station, and I had a, a leather jacket on. A leather jacket that many, I think even Brendan Kirby, has said, "Oh, I, li I really like right, that jacket." It's a nice jacket. It's a nice jacket. Yeah. So I, I go to the party here, and our general manager Pat says to me, "Goes, oh, Willie says I, I like that jacket." Yeah. My wife is standing, and she's like, "What'd oh, she say?" I really don't care for it. Stop it. So then, then <laughs> this is she's going. Going up. No, She's going up volumes this is what's going in my up. book. I love that. Brittany Trumpy, who, who also yes. worked here, my wife turns to her and says, so Brittany, do you like that? And Brittany goes, no. Stop it. <laughs> so now I'm standing You've there. You've got to bring the jacket tomorrow. Can you bring it tomorrow? Yes, I think it's a nice jacket. Okay, like, we're going to bring like the jacket it. tomorrow. I liked the jacket, but everybody else didn't seem to care for it. Oh, my God. I yes. love that. I love yeah. that. And they weren't doing like to be mean, but at the, t at the end of the day. They were I, mad real with you. <laughs> at the end of the day, I looked at our general manager, Pat, and I was just like, Oh, oh he, he, he like he was just like oh what did I <laughs> what did I walk into what did I walk into when I start? what happened what happened oh. Brendan I fashion I have, for men. Uh, it's so fun you know what Will I I don't care for it either no <laughs> you're the one who said you like no, it no I do like it I'm yes. only teasing it's a great jacket but, but don't you wish that like somebody who knew fashion could take us two boneheads because I think as you can get, we like do a call out to anybody yeah, out there like, that knows take anything us about like, like men's fashion and I don't we know though over I think we these do guys? Audrey we dress pretty well here on the show I think you look great yeah and I've got my Air Jordan twos on nice look at that Oh my God. Oh, God. oh God! All of a sudden, we've become the Rockettes. Yes. <laughs> We're not showing any leg. Well, I don't but, know. Here you go. <laughs> you. <laughs> All of a sudden, it's a construction site. <laughs> but you know how much I love Jerry Seinfeld. Yes. And I have told one of my favorite jokes by him is, "Men tend to dress." <laughs> like the last good year of their lives. You know, I agree with that. Stuck. <laughs> and I find that I'm doing that more and more stuck. stuck. Yes. Right. Where are you stuck? About maybe 15. <laughs> no. 16. <Brandon? laughs> 
What about you? I, I think I've evolved with the trends pretty well. Yeah. But I am reaching a point where I don't know if I have any more fashion moves in me. Yeah. Like I'm like, okay, what's the next trend? I might have one more. You might have right. one more. Oh, you got moves. Oh, I got moves. Yeah. <laughs> we're, we're young. We're all young. <laughs> Are we even on the air? <laughs> I don't know. You know I don't really care. <laughs> just, we're having a blast. Let's He's check in. Leg. I check mean, we're... With our viewers right now, when it comes to fashion, you guys had some great comments this morning, as you do each and every day. James opens things up. He says, with the rags I wear, I would say I need someone to help me with fashion. Yes, and you have to say it like that. You do. Fashion. Linda adds, I'm more into fashion than my husband. <laughs> Shock of the year. Uh, he usually asks for my opinion when we go out. But Audrey, that's good. He's asking for an He's asking. Yeah, I, like I think that. that's a big step. Lucy does influence her husband's wardrobe, saying yes, unless I want him leaving the house looking like a homeless person. <laughs> New from Ralph Lauren, it's the Hobo Collection. And Dennis closes things out today saying, definitely not, my wife has great fashion taste, so he's not criticizing. So whether going out to do her gardening or 